Okay, this is Naked Knight, and according to my calculations, Naked Knight has uh, amassed 970,000 viewers uh, a night, and uh, 500,000 viewers a morning. How can we uh, attest to that? Simple, I saw in Charles that week, not to tell you what, and that's coming up right now. Please, what else we have on that? After tonight's weeknight update episode, let's show a compilation of funny moments on the site watch together. Lots of laughter ahead. And to wrap tonight's program up, our late night movie time has a good movie to start October in just a few days. Don't miss it. Alright. Alright, so... What do, uh, these, uh, experts recommend? We recommend you to stay tuned. This is Naked Night. People have always wanted a late night show that really speaks out to them. You know, to make them feel that, you know, uh, everything is going to be alright. Well, there's only one option for you, and that's week not update. It's starting right now. Let's get it on. From the YouTube Dojo, yep, where the autumn leaves love to fall. It's week now after the Daily Mueller, and now man who thinks that that's opening announcement uh, is a little too weird, but hey, he loves the Omni, so what can you do? Mr. Eric on the Mueller! <laughs> Welcome to week now after the Daily Mueller, I'm Eric on the Mueller, I'm Eric Now, those of you who are probably wondering, uh, you know, how uh, does someone pronounce uh, my first name? Well, you know, as you know, uh, my first name is Early, but I, I believe uh, the French would, uh, would call me Early. No, wait, not Early. Uh, they would call me uh, Early. Yeah. You know, what, not to be confused with the uh, the word. Uh, no, wait. Early, that's what uh, people call about someone who's uh, not really on time, but not really late either. But, uh, you know what I mean? Right? So, uh, Anyway, just call me Ellie, alright? Anyway, you know, the theme song was composed by Babylon Creations. And the bumpers were made by Diamond.cam. Uh, yeah, Diamond.cam. And the previews were made by Free Source, Jacob Rock and And now, shout out to our are as follows Specs, Spire Cannon, Span Edits, Monty Jump, Fanatic, Audio Fanatic, and Super Cop Fanatic, all things on mobiles. We can load up the streams and one. One split up and guns with AO Jingles Cannon with uh, Radio Jingles and whatnot. And then the two men with some cartoons. Oh. I'm sorry, it's just I had to, uh, explain, uh, to people, you know, how to pronounce, uh, my first name. You know, whether, uh, you know, some people, you know, you can call me Ellie, I'm cool with that, you know, because that's, that is my name. Although, uh, the French would call me, uh, Ailey. You know, you know, things like that. So, uh, you know, but I'm still working in Mueller here. Ellie, or, yeah, Ellie. Or Ailey, no, it's El Ellie or Ailey Kangi Mule. Yeah, but Ellie is uh, right there. Okay, anyway, what's up? What's up with the autumn leaves? They're about to fall on the ground. Of course, someone has to wake them away. Now, did you know that the leaves change colors because they have stopped making food for themselves? Well, Cold Air can do that, you know. Look it up. Now here is the fall foliage forecast. An expert said that once the Midwest and Colorado start getting cooler with uh, normal weather, those places can see uh, cool autumn leaves. The east will have them for a short spell because of a cold, because of a cold front and a huge drought. Meanwhile, the west won't get any until Sophia Carson tells everyone that she and Daisy Puentes are twins. Oh my goodness. <sighs> I'm sorry folks. It's just that, you know, uh, you know, some people uh, might wonder how to uh, pronounce my uh, first name and things like that and I have to uh, explain that uh, to you folks. And, ay, 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 ay. It's just ridiculous, okay? But anyway, let's do a top 8 list for MP and Mr. Bones. Oh, here we go. Oh, 
Okay, what's the category? Tonight's category, top eight things that the autumn leaves want us to do before they start falling. Number eight, rake them after two weeks. Number seven, refrain from collecting them. Number six, watch but not stare. Watch but don't stare, okay? Whatever. Number five, refrain from crushing them. Number four, refrain from using them as flotation devices. Number three, use them to make gar our gardens grow in March. Number two, keep the youngsters from trying to put them back on the trees. And number one, turn them into Sophia Carson's outfits. Huh? I know, this is weird. And uh, so far, the bloopers and everything else, you know, and Mr. Mueller's uh, mishaps really uh, made everything all goofy. You think? Yeah. Very, very goofy. Oh, boy. Thank you, boys. Thank you. We'll be right back. Again, still call it week now update. Now, here it is. You're fine tonight. Story time. The store clerk believed he had put the wrong cans on the shelf. Ah, but he was right all along. Oh. If you suffer from the late night TV blues, it's Nick at night for the deja views. All night, every night. Okay, stop looking at your TV for just a second and look down at your floor. Do you really like what you see there? If you do, you can skip the rest of this commercial, but if you don't, why in the world do you live with it? You'd be amazed at how inexpensive a new carpet can be when you order it from Empire, and how quickly you'll have it one day. Free credit for six months, too, including no payment for 90 days. Call me, huh? 588 Empire. Empire today, carpet tomorrow. And, and free, free credit, credit for, for six, six months. months. Ladies and gentlemen, how are you doing tonight, Ed? I'm doing alright. Uh, I can't help but uh, tell that uh, there was a little bit of confusion tonight. Yeah, well, some people were wondering uh, you know, how to pronounce uh, my first name. You know, why? Well, I guess uh, some people are watching the show for the first time they want to know what uh, some things that way you know if they ever decide to talk about me then uh, they'll actually uh, get it right the first time and things like that wait a minute your name is ellie ellie Mueller or ellie Connie Mueller right that's right e-l-i-e -E, that's my first name m-u-l-l-e-r ellie Mueller of course uh you know, yeah okay so uh there you go Although the French uh, call you, what was it, Ailey? That's right, they call me Ailey. Not, uh, Early. You know, because that could be, uh, E-A-R-L-Y, and that's not me. My name is E-L-I-E. That's right. Oh, man, now we're getting uh, way out of topic. You think? Anyway, I love all leaves. You know, they just uh, seem so, uh, crisp and so colorful. Yeah, ooh, it's time for uh, talking time. Let's talk about it. Yes, ah, oh my goodness. Let's talk about it. Alright, here we go. Now, let's take a look at this, alright? You know what? Now, this is very interesting, right? You know, all the leaves uh, change colors every year in the fall. 
you know, you know, because it's all the other the cycle, right? It's all about the cycle. You see, that's what we thought, okay? You know, we thought that, you know, uh, once the leaves change colors and they fall, they help the trees get ready to uh, get new leaves in the spring. But there's more to that. You know, because apparently, when uh, the cooler temperatures uh, come into play and the longer nights uh, start uh, you know, entering uh, the scene, the leaves stop making food. You know, believe it or not, leaves do uh, make food. You know, and chlorophyll is the prime player in photosynthesis. That's the process of changing sunlight energy into sugars that nourish the tree. But without that food from the leaves, the chlorophyll uh, has to be broken down and absorbed. Wow. That's uh, pretty interesting, you know. Of course, uh, a blue leaf in the fall is very rare and scientists really don't know why you know and uh an even better answer uh as to why uh they don't exist is because uh blue pigment is very rare in nature hmm really hmm well I guess that's uh, scientific uh, enough. Oh, wait a minute. Is it? I don't know. I mean, ever since uh, you know, the show started, my mind's been uh, going everywhere lately. And I apologize for that, okay? Now, I promise that that will never happen again. But anyway, listen to this, okay? Now, it's time for the... Uh, we're going to look at the uh, the autumn leaves forecast, or the fall foliage, as uh, people say. You know, according to uh, one expert, aka Jen Salk, from the Yankee Magazine, you know, uh, he said, you know, listen to this, right? Normal weather brings about the best foliage because the trees are used to the prevailing, I mean, the prevailing Excuse me, sorry. The trees are used to a prevailing climate that they grow in. Areas they experience close to normal weather will experience the best color. Now, normal weather for this time of year, aka autumn, well, since we're in early autumn, it's usually around uh, 69 degrees Fahrenheit to around 74 degrees Fahrenheit. But as the autumn progress, you know, uh, the temperatures will start uh, going uh, down low. And by the way, I use Fahrenheit because uh, I'm here in the United States of America. Other people around the world will use Celsius, but we're not going to get into that, okay? You know, anyway, as uh, the autumn progresses, the temperatures will start to uh, decrease a lot more. So, be careful. But anyway, so I said... The Eastern Colorado and the Midwest are the best uh, autumn league shows in the country. Because uh, we, when I say we, I mean uh, the people in Eastern Colorado and here in the Midwest, where I live, you know, have uh, experienced the closest to normal weather in history. As for well, uh, the Northeast, they say they'll have, the people over there will see a punch a vibrant but short-lived color. That's due to the drought and things like that. Man. you think that uh, there will be a little bit more rain over there, but I guess not. Meanwhile, uh, in the mid-Atlantic in New York, you know, a hot uh, summer means that there will be uh, higher temperatures in the fall. You know, which is what I said earlier. Southeast will have uh, brief foliage uh, snow. And as for uh, the Northwest, you know, uh, they say it's hard to predict. But I think uh, I know uh, what, uh, what needs to happen in order for uh, the whole thing uh, to actually uh, take place. And that's very simple. Sophia Carson have to uh, go on television and say that uh, 
and she and Daisy Fuentes have gone shopping together. It's just that simple. Alright? That's the show for tonight. You know, I'm sorry for, uh, you know, various parts of the show, uh, again, uh, being a little too much, but, you know, I had to, uh, set uh, something straight, and, you know, because of that, you know, my mind goes, uh, all over the place, and sometimes it allows me to make, uh, a lot more mis mistakes, or many more mistakes, and I apologize for that again, because I just made another one. Hopefully that will never happen again. All right, because you want a show that's uh, that's fun, that's great, and more importantly, it does not have uh, so many mistakes. I know what, uh, what makes you laugh. Anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow. Okay, that's news. I'm Elsky. Spill all that all. If you suffer from the late night TV blues, it's Nick at night for the deja vu. All night, every night.